Inside all the candidates. After less than a year, the new uniforms you've heard so much about, worn by thousands of American Airlines employees, are going to get replaced. Jason Allen, live for us over at DFW Airport. What's the agreement now on replacing all these things? Well, this is going to affect Doug, not just the flight attendants, but also the pilots of these planes, the, the gate agents, the customer service representatives. So that's over 70,000 employees who are now all going to get new uniforms with a new fabric and all of this coming from a new supplier as well. You know, when the new uniforms first came out last fall, flight attendants, it was the biggest group at first that started reporting skin breakouts and headaches and rashes and respiratory problems. American and the manufacturer Twin Hill out of Houston, they both said that testing showed that the uniforms were safe. Well, last month, the airline and the union, they were at an impasse over a new round of testing. And meanwhile, the reports kept coming in. The flight attendants said they insisted on a complete replacement, and that is what the airline has now agreed to do. Well, I think that 3,500 flight attendants speaks for itself. 3,500 flight attendants who have sent in their reports of very real situations that they're experiencing. So the work groups, including the flight attendants, are going to be part of this process now of helping to find a new supplier. The rub here is that's not easy. In fact, it could take two to three years now for this process to play out and get the new uniforms in here. In the meantime, employees still have the option of choosing some different uniforms made in some different fabrics if they are indeed having problems with the ones that they are wearing now. Live out of DFW Airport, Jason Allen, CBS 11 News.